Hi, I'm Phil from the Buzz Business Network, and today I'm going to talk to you about how do you market your business on the internet. If you think it's primarily all about having a nice looking website and some content containing research keywords, well you're probably going to be disappointed with the results. While that approach might have worked once, it won't work today, at least not that if that's not all you're doing. Why not? Of course, optimizing your website so it is attractive to the search engines is important. Nobody ever achieved business success on the internet by being virtually invisible and search engine optimization remains critical. Even so alone it can't deliver the goods for you in terms of site traffic and conversions. At least part of the reason for that is due to the fact that the search engines are becoming increasingly discriminatory in terms of site rankings and more people are also aware of and practicing good basic SEO techniques. So you can't just sit back and hope your keywords will do it all for you. Supporting strategies. As a result it's more important than ever to have a multi-threaded approach to your internet marketing. You need to think about a number of dimensions here including advertising in high visibility publications be that online or conventional the use of business directory entries and appropriate online resources of that nature. Building and maintaining a presence in a social media environment. The use of pay-per-click and other related piggybacking techniques on other sites. There is also an entire range of marketing techniques that may sound to be rather traditional but which have an important role in the internet market in place. They might include things such as sponsorships, contributions to various forums, promotions, sales, discounts and freebies. In other words, you need to do the full range of techniques designed to persuade someone who has just come across your site's advertisement that is worthwhile going off to visit you to find out more. Research and development. There is no one size fits all approach to internet marketing. Some techniques may be far more applicable to some organizations than others. For example, marketing approaches that may work very well with certain demographics may be spectacularly less successful with others, just as is the case in the bricks and mortars marketing world. This is a highly specialized subject and one that is usually advisable to entrust to experts. Apart from anything else, they may save you spending heavily on an approach that is unlikely to yield any sort of acceptable return on investment. Being seen. The primary consideration of internet marketing is to achieve visibility to begin with. Understanding where to place advertisements for your business proposition and ensuring that they are correctly segmented to be picked up by the appropriate business directories and engines should be your main initial objective. Of course, the subsequent critically important consideration is how to convert visitors into income stream generating customers. That takes your considerations into the domain of internal marketing and sales, as opposed to that which is orientated towards getting your site on the public's radar. In summary, it is a complex area and not one where it would be sensible to make rash assumptions. This is adapted from an article by E.A. Matthew. For more info visit searcheasy.com.au Please like the video if you found it useful and subscribe to our channel for more videos. I hope you have a nice day and I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye.